Hi guys, so I got here a SPS 930 uh, from Trimble and I want to take a look at the quick uh, adjustment in case your gun is a little bit off. So first of all you want to turn it on and as you can see, as you can see it's starting in a thing so we want to head to the level and we want to go at least to 1 to 10 and perform the uh, level by using the screws play the game and now we have it um, perfectly in the center so we're gonna rotate 90 degree and uh, you saw a little jump there which is okay let's do the 180 again and yeah pretty still center and again 180 and yeah pretty center so once you hit exit well you can go to setup and then we want to go down 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 to adjustments we're gonna hit the enter button and now we have uh, Compensator calibration, so we're gonna hit that and you know make sure that the handle is attached and hit enter. And it make sure that the control unit is not attached, which it's not. And we just have a plate. I guess that would be uh, has something to do with the with the weight. And now, as you can see, it's gonna perform its own like dance and it's gonna perform the compensation calibration. Okay, so that that performs the compensation calibration. Oops, you see that. So now we can go to horizontal and ve vertical cal collimation error. So let's hit that and basically follow the plans, right? So currents are zeros. So let's aim at the target and perform this. So let me pause this. So I have aimed at the target and we're gonna hit new observation. So phase one observation, right? And then we can change phase. And set the target again. Right? I'm gonna adjust that because it's a little bit off. You guys can see the target. No. Okay, so now we're gonna go back, back, and hit the new observation. Right, and as you can see, it's a quite a bit off. So we're gonna hit that. We're gonna hit that. So I did a couple of phases, three in each, and then it uh, did the horizontal vertical calibration, collimation. So the next one here is the tracker collimation. So you're gonna hit that, 
current values, okay, continue. And it's asking us to aim a target and hit a new observation, but it's not locked. So for that, you have to put in a prism. So for the tracker uh, uh, calibration, we need to put in a prism. So I'm gonna go and set up a prism there and we'll, we'll go from there. So as you can see, it gave us a uh, distance less than 100 meters. <coughs> Results may be inaccurate. So we're gonna hit OK. And it did some adjustment, so we store that. And then we have a laser pointer. So next on and uh, you can I don't know if you can see that but it's pointing the laser so, which is good and hit next and hit set and we have autofocus calibration so we can hit aim at prism and focus manually distance 500 meters so obviously we do not have 500 meters but i'm gonna focus manually and aim at that prism so i did focus then we hit okay and it's doing its own thing and it's saying us basically ta Target is too close, so we would have to move it to the to the further away. So yeah, this is a basically quick and uh, easy calibration which you can perform by yourself. And uh, what you need, the other thing to do is uh, when you do the vertical, you point it up. You just follow the prompts. Uh, yeah it's uh, obviously it's nice to uh, choose a day like today where it's overcast so your uh, you know refractions and everything are minimal but yeah so once more when you go to setup at the bottom you have adjustments and once you have those adjustments then you just follow the prompts I recommend doing it, you know, just like with the machine control when it's a change of the weather, right? So winter and summer, so season. And yeah, very easy, very nice gun, very quiet, very fast. So see you in the next one.